you don't see that often when I'm doing this. How's it going, everyone? I'm Astronomy Dave, and welcome back to the Crooked Man. Welcome to scene five, which, when I looked it up, this is supposed to be the last scene in the game. So, this will probably be the last episode as well. Hi. This is the place, for sure. Could this be his house? I literally don't know what to do here, though. Hi! Excuse me. Can I have a second? What? Ain't seen you around here. Going for a stroll? Uh, no, actually. Um, who lives here? Do you know them? Oh, you mean Mrs. McGahan? McGahan? Who? McGahan? Someone named McGahan lives here? Not anymore. Mrs. McGahan passed away last year. The house has been neglected ever since. Waste of a fine house it is. Oh yeah. I think she had a son. Wish he'd just rent out or sell the house. Do you know anything about her son? Nah, never seen him. I only moved here a few years back. Heard he lives in an apartment a ways away. This is his place. I see. Is that all? I gotta get home by daybreak, or my wife will be livid. It's good. It's good to take a walk in the morning, but it's sure cold. Don't catch a cold or nothing. Uh, yes. Thank you. You too. Okay, bye bye Um. Oh, good. All right, we're not just gonna barge in. That sounds like a good thing. Mailbox says McGahan. Must have been the resident's name. You're no kidding. Never would have figured that one out. Nothing's growing. Nothing's growing. Uh, excuse me? Hello? Can I come inside? Please? Alright, well, I mean, it's locked. Table and chair covered in dust. Eh. Uh, eh. Uh, well, I don't... Wait, what the... I thought there was like a random detail that didn't make sense. Nope. Huh. Hello? 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 Can I please come in? Can I... Jeez. Oh, Hello? Can I please come in? Ah, for the love of... Um... Excuse me? Excuse me, but this is rude. Also, shut up, phone. Am I going to have to consult a walkthrough for the last little bit of all this? Ah! What the hell? Why? Why is there nothing? I am literally searching everything. Oh my god. What the hell? Do I have like a key or something? A blood let me guess, the blood key goes here. I forgot I had that. Really? Okay then. I don't like this. Wash basin. The mirror has a big crack in it. Oh boy. Toilet water reeks. Bath water is mucky. It smells bizarre. Washing machine. 
Yay. I don't like these sounds. Pieces of shattered plates that I'm not allowed to walk past, apparently. What's in the trash can? Okay. Found a scrap from a notebook. What does this one say? The hotel, the school, the hospital. It was the same at all of them. My saddest memories wouldn't go away. Writing wouldn't calm down my heart. In the end, my festering heart just oozes more and I tear up the paper. Mine is an empty existence. I have nothing to leave behind. Not even words. That's horrible. Here, I'm going to move my angling a little bit. That is horrible. Oh. Fallen radio. Excuse me, there's a strange voice coming from the radio. Um, excuse me? Early morning, apparently, a dirty bed. Found a scrap from the. Of course I did! Why? 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 Um, excuse me. Out of cigarettes. I need a smoke. Egg. Excuse your face. Wait. I want to make sure I didn't miss anything from downstairs. Did I miss any scraps? I want to make sure I get the whole story. I guess not, okay. Wait, double check the washer. What if the washing machine has one inside? Nope. I guess it would have told me the first time if it did. Is there any paper in here? Oh, I see that. I see the one in the back. You can't hide from me. Then I scrap from a notebook. Okay. I recalled the rhyme of the crooked man. All he could do was live in a crooked house. With a cat and a mouse just as crooked. I was the same way. Everything I wished for ended up crooked. My dreams, my love, even my family. Dark? How did the crooked man live? Was he sorrowful? In the depths of despair? Such a life has no me- The crooked man is not literal. Not until you came around, at least. Forest. Okay. I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss any uh, notebook pieces. I want to try to endorse myself into as much of the story as I can. I got the one in here already. Got the one in there. So there's nothing much else to do. Drawers, nothing in them. I still have the pit, the revolver, so... Okay, just in case, because I'm going to go crazy. I'm surprised I haven't deleted that yet. Alright, let's go. There's a door leading up to the attic, but it won't open. Excuse me? Oh my god. Just burn the door. No? Oh. I am legitimately not certain what to do. Paintings fall onto the floor. Must have been hung on the wall before. 
so why not hang it back up? Just burn this. Okay, I guess not. Nope, that one net. Um, I don't know. This is the most confusing. Stop it. No. Absolutely not. I am literally deep hunting everywhere because I have the rule on this notebook, not just the scraps I have, combined all the scraps into the notebook. There's a name on this. Duke. Duke McGahan. I'm sorry if I'm saying that wrong. Excuse me? <laughs> okay, we're saving again. Is he in here? Crooked man. I I can't go over to your side. He's up there, isn't he? And I'll be going there. This will be the end. Oh, ho, ho. okay. So I'm gonna give this one sh one or two tries. Um, if I can't beat it in those amount of tries, I will. Pause the footage and resume once we have hit defeat on this guy. Because I have no idea how difficult this is going to be. that I win that was easy that was really wait what ah oh, god damn it okay I thought I won but I lost God. Okay, that is strong. Uh, so don't get hit at all. Got it. Okay. Actually, we'll give this one more shot. Two.
What the hell? Okay. Be back in a sec. Oh, boy. Okay. I know it's refading back in, but you know what? I need a breather. I'm not even going to say how many tries that took because I lost track a while ago. Okay. I actually clicked out of the window so it doesn't progress. I'm a little bit delayed, but as we can see, in the small amount that we can actually see, we beat the Crooked Man. I hope. <laughs> Crooked Man? Crooked Man? I'm not going to be like you. You won't catch me. As much misery as I encounter, as painful and bloody as it might be, I'll keep living. Aw. That's awesome. Now what? So. Be gone! Wait, whoa, really? Okay. Definitely yes. Whoa. I like that. How how do you how did they do that? What wait what RP, first of all what engine is this what like what maker is this? It's RPG Maker obviously, but which one? I want to learn how to do that. There's a door to the attic. You might be able to pry it open. Let's do it. All right. So what do we got? Duke. He's been dead for a while. You... You detested me. Though I lived such a similar life, you hated how I lived comfortably. So... You wanted to drag me down, to take me with you. Duke is the crooked man. Hmm. Okay. But didn't you want to be saved deep down? So, you called me. No, that's not right. You were trying to help me. To tell me, don't come the way I've come. Probably a little bit of both. Okay, for a moment I thought that wasn't me. Thank you. Nothing will make you suffer anymore. Where you're going, it's a good place. So... Now, you can rest in peace. I thought I was going to, I don't know, I, 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 just, I don't know, I don't know what to think, wow, sounds like a real ordeal, David, I mean, finding a corpse while you're on a trip, but it sounds like it ended up alright, yeah, I mean, I guess, yeah, I'll go get you some tea. Are you okay, Paul? You've been looking away for a bit. He was beaten by the crooked man. He was dragged to the other side. Wait! What? Excuse me? Are you telling me Duke is not the crooked man? The crooked man was always right behind me. I realized he was there. Every time I was sad, I felt like he was whispering to me. Metaphorical for the depressing thoughts. I'm not going to say how impeccable timing this was. I knew if I acknowledged it, I was done for. So I tried not to think about it. 
If all this hadn't happened, I think sooner or later, I'd take his same path. Suicide? Thinking of it that way, he really did save me. Always such an easy target, aren't you? That's why you got dragged into this. Oh, it's fine. The crooked man is gone. Hello? Huh? Oh, okay. Uh, I'll head there right now. Or, uh, well, same thing. I'll head right there. David? What's up? Who was it? The hospital. Mom's condition took a turn. They're preparing to do the operation. Take my bike. It'll be faster. You gotta go. Don't sit there staring. Doctor. Mom. Mom's condition. To be honest, this is rather risky. Removing the tumor isn't too difficult. But she might not have the strength to... Doctor. Please. My mom. She's... She's the only family I have. Please. Sign this. We're getting ready now. We'll do the best job we can. That's all I can do. Okay. Doctor. Mom. Mom? The tumor was successfully removed. She's still sleeping now. You might have a chance if she wakes up. Tonight will be the biggest hurdle. Have faith in her. David? Mom! Mom. Oh, thank God. You woke up. You really... I felt like I was in darkness. I was scared, screaming. I must have worried you. Those things I did to you. I'm so sorry. It was hard, wasn't it? It's okay. It's okay. You helped me open my eyes. Mom, I was so unhappy. I was always just struggling to be happy. But I didn't give my mother the happiness she needed. After all the hardship I had given her. I foolishly doubted. Thought I wasn't loved. Wasn't needed. That's why I... Do you hate me for it? Don't be silly, David. Indeed, you and I both. It's hard to say we were always happy. But even in sad times, you were always honest. You lived a straight and honest life. I was so proud of you. Having you as a son was my greatest happiness. Don't focus on the sad things. I'm sure you'll notice all the happiness hiding around you. Davy, I'm thirsty. Can you bring me some water? Sh sure, just a second. Don't, don't die.
And of course, I had to talk. Mom? Mom. Got a good funeral. I'm sure your mother's happy now. You gotta be tired, huh, David? You okay? She told me she was happy in the end. If I'm going to live without blaming myself, those words are going to help a lot. fine if I have to suffer. If I can be smiling in the end. David. Marion? Why are you... Shirley? Why are you... Hey, Shirley. I still ain't forgiven you. Thanks for the English, Paul. How dare you give David the cold sh- Okay. Um. <clears throat> we're going. Okay, okay, stop pinching me. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I can't help but laugh at that. David, I heard about your mother. So... You brought flowers, Shirley. Mom always liked you. I bet she, she's glad. Thanks. David, I was uneasy. I got unsure of where I was going. Worried that the road I was walking would be full of twists and turns. So I took it out on you and your kindness. You never let me down. But how did I repay you? I'm really the worst of the worst. I'm sorry. Maybe this is too late, but... David? If it's okay with you, would you like to... David, I'm sorry. Please don't cry. Too late. <laughs> Real David is starting to put up tears. <laughs> this is a horror game. <laughs> no, I'm not sad. I'm just... Even though my dreams were crushed and I just lost... My only family. I'm just so happy you came back. It's okay, Shirley. However off kilter things get, we can set them straight. That's what we want. David. You know what I think? What? The crooked man had a crooked body and only crooked things. But I'm sure he was happy living in his crooked house.
I hope to see you again. Until then, rest in peace. I did... I did not expect that to have such a compelling story. I... Granted, most hor most of the best horror games always have core on such deep topics, and the stories are always fantastic. But... I did not have my expectations very high on this just because of how, like, how old school the game is. Granted, though, to be fair, this is actually version 4 of the original game. I don't remember what the original game was, like, what the differences were, just stuff like that. I'm probably going to just see if I can dig and find, like, um... A different version of this just just to see what it was like because I completely missed it and I am very curious but overall I <laughs> I don't know if we got all the endings or not all the bad it I think we got all of them I think thank you for playing the crooked man and congrats on the good ending this is a bonus area you lose access to it if you quit so I recommend making a save you can also begin a second playthrough here. Huh? Wait. Excuse me? I mean, I don't plan on playing it again. I'm curious what would happen, but I don't plan on playing this again. Unless on my own time. About the series. This ends the Crooked Man. But the series continues with the Sandman, the Boogeyman, and the Hanged Man. Out as of 2017. I will get to those. And like this one, I will definitely give credibility to everyone who deserved it. This was a fantastic experience. <laughs> I, that, I did not expect that. And yeah, I didn't ball out crying. It's rare to get, get me to do that. It's... Well, no, it's rare to get me to do what this game got me to do in the end. It's super rare to get me to actually legitimately cry. Kudos to you guys for being able to actually get me to just tear up in general. Please try them if you'd like. I will. I definitely will. With the experience I had with this one, if it's about the same, I definitely want to try it out. I don't know. I I'm going to try. If it's like the same style, all of them are just basically this type of RPG, then I'm definitely going to give them a shot. If not, I'll definitely at least try them on my own. But I did want to show this off for classics reason, and I loved going through the Crooked Man. A great experience. I had... It didn't have, like, the kind of jump scares that, like, Misao had um, when I played through that. But the small little battle systems and the compelling story... Um, Misao did have a great story, but I, I'm sorry. I think the story in this one was quite a bit better. Um, just because... I'm going to take this off, that way I can focus on talking specifically. Um, I'm someone who has... A mental state of like neurology physiology psychology philosophy stuff like that and this hit home on me hard and I really enjoyed it for those of you who want to give this a shot on your own um, at least for this video I'm going to have a link in the description for the game itself I really do recommend it it's very cheap um, it's like three bucks I think at max five I don't remember how much I bought this for I bought all four games for $10-ish, so I think it was like 3 bucks. I might be wrong. Um, 
But I definitely recommend it for anybody who likes philosophy slash psychological horror type games. Uh, well, psychological games, horror games, horror RPGs, and classics. I do recommend trying it out. Um, credibility to everyone that went through the credits and everybody who um, did this game. I know this has been an extensive episode, but to me personally, I think it was worth it. But in any case, I am going to leave this episode and the series here. So thank you guys so much for watching The Crooked Man. Have you missed any of the series at all? I'll have the link to that. This playlist, across my head, I really do recommend checking it out. If you missed anything, um, you might not understand everything here, but I I really do recommend it. Uh, if you don't want to check it out, though, then at least try the game itself. Again, link in the description below. If you want to check out any other RPG or horror games or both that I've done prior to this, I'll probably have Misa out there just for the sake of similarities in to an extent. I'll have that uh, down over here. However, in the meantime, I'm going to head out, but I'll see you guys later. Bye!